Wyoming versus ranked team. We get number nine, uh, Oklahoma State at number 16, Baylor. This is a rematch of the Big 12 championship we saw last year. Uh, right now, Big 12 wide open. Baylor favored at home by two and a half to total 54 and a hook, Brady. I'm on the uh, the side of Oklahoma State here. I just think they're the better football team because, uh, because of how Spencer Sanders has been playing at quarterback. Uh, he's really taken leaps and strides from where he was a year ago, where I feel like they relied more on their defense. That was the top in the Big 12. They relied more on the rushing attack. Now I feel like he's taking over games. And so he's gotten to a different dimension for me. You know, they're coming off the bye. I think that's going to play uh, a little bit of a role here too. But as I kind of look through it, like this is really one of their first road tests to date. Their defense isn't what it used to be because Jim Knowles is now at Ohio State, not in Stillwater. I'm a little bit concerned about this one because I do think Baylor's found their identity after that loss to BYU a couple weeks ago, running the football. Blake Shavitt's playing much better. I'll take the two and a half points. I mean, this is one of those that I think it's going to come down to probably that final drive and whoever has the football is going to win. But I'll take the two and a half here in Oklahoma State. Baylor had a really nice win last week against Iowa State. I, st I like Oklahoma State to win this game outright. Um, Spencer Sanders, to me, is kind of, we're talking about quarterbacks figuring it out. I, I, I'm a little bit worried because he's been a roller coaster ride. I mean, even going back to the last two games last year, Big 12 Championship, he was awful. Bowl game, he was great. But he's been playing great this season, and I'm counting on him to put those, you know, rocky performances behind him with all the turnovers because I'm with you. I think they're the better team, yeah. and I think he has the edge at quarterback, and he's been playing. I mean, it's been like we haven't seen him that much because only three games and they had the bye week. But I think from what I've seen, I love what I'm getting. Two things. Last year he started the season, got a little banged up, and yeah. I don't know how healthy he was. And then we saw him this season, the way he started off. I mean, he's been was, has been tearing it up. Maturity too. I, I think with maturity comes more consistency with how you prepare, how you play, and we're seeing a more mature Spencer Sanders right now at the quarterback spot. Last week you guys um, had six lock unity picks. We begin with three right off the top here, uh, but quite a few ranked versus ranked teams as we recap what we've seen so far between Brady and Danny and their picks thus far. They both like Arkansas and the under. They both say take Clemson and the over and Oklahoma State and the under as well. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.